Hi, this is Peter Stanley. Welcome to my channel. Um, today I've got a Carbonara cream to review. And I got this seed from Tony Sherwood, and he's the creator of the um, original Carbonara, which is like a or more of an orange color of pepper. And that's a three-way cross between a Indian carbon boot and a seven-pot yellow and a and an, an orange hat. So I don't know what the... Um, goes into making the cream version of that um, but it reveals a natural I guess something else is crossed with it but I'm not sure but um, if you have any questions contact Tony Sherwood um, so I got the seeds from it's a very prolific plant and yeah, anyway let's go ahead and take a look at the plant and um, come back and we'll cut this open and give it a taste okay here's my um, carbonero cream It's a pretty prolific plant. You can see all those pods up in there. There's some ripe. There's one there. We got this other guy here. Yeah, the Carbonara is a creation of Tony Sherwood, and I don't know if the cream variant is... I got the seeds from him, so I'm assuming it's another one of his, but I don't know if it was, you know, the story behind it, but the pods are really good. There's another one. They kind of turn like a pale yellow after they ripen a little bit. Yeah, it's a really thick bushy plant. I need to pick a bunch of these and go ahead and freeze them or something. But uh, it's real dense, a lot of foliage. And, uh, yeah, so that's Carbonaro cream. 11.2 grams. It's a little over two and a half inches long and about an inch wide. Some nice little droplets of oil. There. There. It's got some as well. I'm seeing a kind of a sweet, slightly chinitsy kind of smell. Right, let's go ahead and um, give it a taste. Alright, so um, back and um, we'll give it a taste. It's got a real mild smell. Not much at all. Okay, it's got a uh, carbonara cream. Yeah, it's real sweet. <clears throat> nice, good, even burn in my mouth. Um, my tongue. Kind of around my lips. A little bit tangy, but it's mostly kind of a... Actually... One of the few that kind of tastes um, how I like it looks. 
um, say other piece. Pretty decent size pods. They're really pretty. Um, <clears throat> I hear my dog in the background. <clears throat> yeah, the seeds add a little bit of a bitterness, I think. Well, maybe it wasn't was much to me with, but it was a little twang in that first piece. But um, the other piece, just eating the, the flesh, um, it tastes a little better than the piece with all the seeds. Uh, <clears throat> Yeah, it's got a, it's not a bad heat, um, maybe less than half an arrow. Um, plant's really prolific, as you can see in the video. I think it'd be really good to experiment on that with some powders and uh, jelly, uh, hot sauce, things like that. Yeah, I really like it. Um, I'll probably end up on my grill list for next year. It's one of the better tasting white cream pods I've tried. Um, I really like the PF439452 one as well. I did a review on that not long ago. It had more of a fruity, tangy flavor. This has more of a base sweet flavor. Uh, <clears throat> uh, can't think of much more to add on that. So the uh, carbonara cream. Single piece left over there. Um, thank you very much for watching, and uh, please like, comment, and subscribe.